be zero and zero back here with another video today. And in today's video, this is some major signing news with the Melbourne Storm and Xavier Coates. So uh, obviously, there's been speculation for the past couple of weeks now that Xavier Coates um, could be heading to the Melbourne Storm in 2022. And now it's confirmed that he will be going to the Storm in 2022 on a um, two-year deal starting next year. So um, I will be talking about that, but. Um, I won't say it now, but I will say it for my live stream that uh, most of you guys should know about later on. But um, I have got 1K subscribers now, so I thank, I thank everyone for um, helping me get there. But I will do a big, big live stream of shoutouts and everything else on that stream. So make sure you're there by 5 o'clock to 5.30, but I'll talk about that all later. But um, yeah, let's get into the signing video. So, Xavier Coates, you know, <clears throat> great player, great winger. Uh, will be a star in the future, no doubt about it. And I think Melbourne Storm picking him up will just benefit his game even more. Um, obviously, with Adokar going to the Bulldogs next year, it's such a smart buy that they've got Xavier Coates heading to the um, Storm next year. Great replacement, great replacement in my opinion. Can only get better from there when he joins the Storm. Uh, obviously, at the Storm, there seem, seems to be whenever a player from a rival club joins the Storm, they just get um, become like a 50 or 10 times better player. It just seems that way, does it? Because... Xavier Coates seems like a gun, and it's, a, it's only scary to think, um, you know, with more time at Storm, how he'll even go in the future, so it's actually pretty scary to think that, you know, that he's um, playing so well at, like, the age of 19 or 20 or something, and, you know, to have maybe a long couple of years at Storm, it'll be really interesting really interesting and really amazing to see how his game go, grows more under, you know, Craig Bellamy for the time that he's there and under the Storm systems. He might be a really, really good player to watch out for the for in the future. I'm really enjoying, I'll really enjoy to see how his development goes under the Storm. But, um, you know, it's a big loss to the Brisbane Broncos. I mean, Broncos are losing heaps of talent at the moment. They... They lost Tom Deaton, who's a local there. They've lost David Fafita. They've lost um, who else? Uh, Reese Walsh uh, recently. Uh, Tony Stagg has just re-signed the Broncos for another four years, so that's good for them. Um, yeah, look, it's far too much talent for them to lose. They're losing a lot of talent. Not, not many players want to be there anymore, unfortunately for them. Um, you know, I, I thought that. I think that. I, I look. Look, they should have kept Xavier Coates. I thought they'll keep him. I thought they'd. Had him wrapped wrapped him up. I thought that the Broncos would make him a major um, a major re-signing priority, but obviously they let they they let the guards slide there, and obviously Bob and Storm have just offered him with a better deal and better better contract for overall for, for Xavier Coates to leave the leave the Broncos at the end of the year. So, in my opinion, in my opinion, it's a very smart idea, a very smart choice by Xavier Coates to leave the Broncos because obviously, look, I, I don't hate Broncos or any, Broncos or anything, but. They're a real, real world, world of pain. They're in all sorts of Broncos. They're still, you know, recovering from that last year and all that. They're just the Broncos are in a building stage, and you know it's going to be a couple, a couple of years until they're up the top. I reckon again. And with the Storm, the Storm are already like a top two team who always come near the Premiership every year, uh, who are always hard to beat and have no dramas like the Broncos do. So I think it's a very good decision for Xavier Coates to make, and also for the rest of his career going to the Melbourne Storm. Definitely going to. Help his game grow even more with Craig Bellamy being there and, and some other senior guys like Munster, Pappenhausen, you know, all those sort of guys. But he'll be really dangerous if, and fit in well for those sort of players at the Storm. But yeah, good signing by the Storm. And I think this is going to be a very, very... Um, I think Xavier Coates will be a really scary player to watch at the Storm. I think he, he his game will get even better. And it's, and it's scary to think. Cause he's only 20 years old or something like that. But guys... That's the end of the video. What are your thoughts on the signing of Xavier Coates and the Melbourne Storm? Do you like it or don't you like it? But guys, make sure you do like the video. Make sure you do subscribe to the channel. And make sure you do comment your thoughts and feedback on the video. And we'll catch you next one.